What's up guys? We got another Cyrax video today. It's the real truth about what the trolls have done to me and my family. So, let's check it out. What's up everyone on Facebook and for my few supporters over on YouTube as well as other platforms. I'm making this video because my family's in danger because of Cyrax Video Games aka CVG and all his little friends. You see for the past few months these people have been putting my family in harm's way. And I do mean direct harm wet. They've been putting my family in danger. And as you guys already may know, they put me in direct danger by having that guy come over here. I defended myself, I beat the case. And like I said, I don't take that win lightly. I don't take my court case win lightly at all. You know, of course you're going to act like you won just because the guy didn't show up. I mean, it was a draw at best, but don't be fucking cocky because you had it dead to rights that you were about to go to fucking jail or go on probation for assault that you definitely fucking committed. But these people are truly fucking evil. They're evil pieces of fucking shit that deserve to be called out and need to be stopped. My family has gone to the police. They won't do anything at all. We've gone to the Federal Bureau of Investigations. They blatantly refuse to do anything. So now I'm asking you guys on Facebook for your help. These people have done so many things to put our family in danger. They have stalked us, followed us. They have tried to steal our car. You know, when the FBI fails, definitely Facebook is going to help you. That's just a really, really smart idea. Twice. They have followed my stepdad to work. They had broken into our car and egged the inside of our car. They have threatened to get the cartel after us. And they are running rampant all over the internet, spreading lies and rumors about me that are not fucking true. Everything everyone says about you is true, Cyrax. I know you hate the fact that all this stuff is true, but it is 100% true. You are a little monster. This morning, I had to watch my stepdad, my stepdad break down into fucking tears. Because he's so fucking tired of this shit. I'm tired of it. My family's tired of it. It needs to fucking stop. My lawyer tried doing something about it and there's nothing that he can do. You know, that's a very interesting take after you were going to sue everyone and take everyone down legally. So, you know, you're admitting that your lawyer can't do shit about mean people on the internet. My family is in danger 24-7 and we're tired of it. These people have tried to have me killed. They have tried to have me kidnapped. These people have been terrorizing my family for months now. Everybody else has moved on. But CVG and his little fuckboy friends are the ones that are still hanging on. And they're putting my life and my family's lives in danger. And we're fucking sick of it. We don't know how to make them stop.
which is why I'm asking any of my friends on Facebook, if any of you have any way to help stop these guys for good. I know a way you can stop it. Stop making these fucking videos. Stop getting online and crying every time there's some problems. Just get off the internet and people won't fuck with you. Please do so. Because I can't bear to watch my family go through this anymore. I've been through enough. I've been through more than enough. I've cried enough tears to last me a lifetime. Now it's at the point to where I'm not... I'm not upset. I'm fucking pissed off. I am fucking tired of these assholes fucking around and fucking with my goddamn family. And my friends, I'm sick of it. I'm sick of these lies and these rumors being spread all for content, money, and views. And that's why they do it. For content, money, and views. No, Cyrax. People do it because you're a monster and you continue to prey on children. You're a horrible person and everyone just wants to tell people to not listen to the little monster's lies. They don't give a fuck about anything. These people don't care who they hurt. These people don't care who they put in danger. All they care about are the clicks and the views and making me into content. And when I don't give them what they want, they threaten my family with violence. They try to steal our car and they try to do things to make me react. And I'm sorry, but I'm fucking sick and tired of going back how I really fucking feel. CVG, you need to fuck off, you little bitch fuck boy, and get a fucking goddamn life, you piece of shit. Nobody fucking likes you. Marty don't like you. None of the trolls that fucked me before, none of them like you. You're a fucking tweeb ass little piece of shit, and you need to fuck off. Move the fuck on, you douchebag. Go the fuck somewhere else and stop harassing me and my fucking family, you fucking piece of shit. You're just mad because I won that fucking case, bitch. You're fucking mad. Well, guess what? I don't give a fuck if you're mad. If anything, I laugh. And I bask in the fact that you're mad. That you're angry. You're angry that you didn't get your way. Oh, you don't think I don't know your little fucking secret? You guys want to know his big fucking secret plan? I'll fucking tell you. I'll fucking tell you guys what his little secrets are. I guarantee you, whatever he thinks he knows is absolutely fucking wrong. I know all about it. See, he runs with this group on this on Discord, it's a very high secret group called the Council of Eight. And see, what their plan was, what their real agenda was, was to have me arrested and then have me killed while I was in prison. When I was in jail, they wanted to get an inmate in there to kill me after spreading lies about me saying that I'm a pedophile when I'm not. That was their big fucking plan. They wanted to have me murdered via the legal system, via an inmate in the county jail. Yeah, that's, that's not what happened. But uh, you said that CVG and Marty and William and Edward Boyd were all on the Council of Hate. But 
you also just said that Marty hates CVG. So, like, it doesn't make any fucking sense. They wanted to have me arrested and then have me killed while I was in jail. That's how sick these fucking people are. And if you ask me, him or none of these motherfuckers that are fucking with me, my friends, or my family deserve to have any internet access. They don't deserve to have a computer. If they think they should be the ones locked up. They should be the ones being attacked. They should be the ones being gone after. And you want to know how I know that they're mad? I made a Reddit under a fake name pretended to be someone else. Right? I pretended to not know who I was. I mentioned the Council of Eight. This motherfucker, CVG, banned me from commenting on his shit. CVG hates Reddit. I really doubt he banned you, but uh, everyone would know it's you the second you started talking about the Council of Eight like they were real. Everyone would know that's Cyrax, because only Cyrax would believe that stupid shit. So yeah, CVG, I know about the Council of Eight. I know what the fuck y'all plan to do. Y'all want me dead. Well, guess what? That's never gonna fucking happen. You guys killing me is not gonna happen. You guys killing my stepdad and my family, not gonna happen. You know, I know you love to be the perpetual victim, Cyrax, but no one wants to kill you. If you're dead, we don't get these screaming content videos. Everyone just wants the world to know that you're a little monster. That's all it is. If anything, I'm gonna fight like hell to make sure that you leave me the fuck alone. Because I have warned you several times to back the fuck off and to leave me the fuck alone. Nigga, you think I'm scared of you? I'm not scared of you, CBG. Bitch, I stood up to Marty, who sweats my size. Marty beat you like a little rag doll. You didn't really stand up to him, and then immediately afterwards, you cried about how he didn't fight fair. Yeah, I may have got my ass beat so fucking what, I still showed up. Your little pussy friend showed up to fuck with me and my family, and I showed him I ain't fucking scared. So you really think I'm scared of a little fuckboy like you, CG? No. But I will tell you this, I'm not about violence. You are. And that's why I come hell and high water, I'm gonna make sure your ass is off the internet for fucking good. To where you can't fuck with me, your friends can't fuck with me, or my family, or my friends. I'm sick of it, and they're all sick of it. We're sick of your fucking little bitch, whiny, crackheaded fucking ass. We're sick of it. You need to back the fuck off, you asshole motherfucker. Fuck off. Get a fucking life and do something else for a change. Hey, Cyrax. Why don't you get a life and do something else other than scream on Facebook about how everyone's just a mean bully to old Cyrax? You're putting my family and my friends and me at risk and in immediate danger, and we're fucking tired of it. No one likes you, CVG. No one likes you. No one. Hell, not even William Gloryhole fucking likes you. Courtney don't like you. Which, by the way, Courtney, if you do see this, 
Happy belated birthday. I hope you had a good one. Cyrax, you are such a fool. No one likes you. Courtney hates you. William hates you. Even if they don't like CVG, they still all fucking hate you, dude. But point being, dude, no one fucking likes you, CVG. You or your little pussy friends. No one can stand you because of what you do. You put people's lives in danger. That is a fucking felony, motherfucker. That is a crime. What you're doing is illegal. Trying to have our cars stolen. Trying to have me murdered by having me arrested and put in a jail cell. That's a crime in itself. That's literally, that's literally premeditated murder. That is literally conspiracy to murder someone. Plus, I have screenshots on my computer of you premeditating a murder against me. That is a fucking crime, you pussy whipped little bitch. That is a crime, motherfucker. So, CVG, I'm telling you this right now. You and your little friends better back the fuck off and leave me, my friends, and my family alone. Otherwise, I will do whatever it takes. I don't care how long. I will do whatever it fucking takes to see to it that you are made to leave me alone. I will show the feds every ounce of fucking shit that you have said to me, putting my life in danger, putting my family's lives in danger, putting my friends in danger. You know, you just said the police and the FBI won't do a goddamn thing for you. And now you're trying to say that they're going to put him away. You're just, you're an idiot. You're crying to Facebook hoping Facebook will help you. You just, you can't even, ugh. Because trust me when I say it, little boy, I have every ounce of evidence that you've ever posted up about me. And also, you just tried to do that in court, and no one wanted to see any of it because no one fucking cares about a 33-year-old man getting bullied on the internet. I have every ounce of premeditating murder. I have every ounce of you slandering my name. Using my image and likeness without my consent to make money. Let's be honest here, CBG. You're just mad at the fact that I'm not doing what you want. You want me on panel for views. Wild well, star, you little fucking crackheaded little bitch. You're not getting views out of me, motherfucker. If anything, I'm going to be working on a way to take legal action against your fucking ass. And against all your little friends. That are putting mine, my family's, and my friends' lives all in danger. So to all my friends on Facebook, I need every single fucking one of you to message me. Because I have an email for you guys to send to YouTube on my behalf. To put a stop to this. I do have an email for you all to send in to make this stop. We need to get law enforcement involved. We need to get the Federal Bureaus of Investigations involved. You just said at the start they don't want anything to do with your stupid bullshit, Cyrax. We need to get the courts and people who can actually do something about this involved. Because I don't deserve this. You guys, my friends, you don't deserve this. My family doesn't deserve this. Your family absolutely deserves to know that you're a piece of shit and they need to stop enabling and protecting you. 
That's the only reason why anyone fucks with your family is because they go out of their way to protect you knowing that you're a monster. So I'm saying right now, I need every single one of my friends that doesn't already have the email, the letter for the email, I need every one of you that does not have it to message me and to send this shit to YouTube and send it by the masses. Have your friends, have your family, have everybody that you can send it to YouTube so we can put a stop to this. So I can live a normal life again, and so my family doesn't have to sit downstairs, scared out of their mind, worrying what's going to happen next. You've already tried this taking him off YouTube attempt. It doesn't work. He just comes back with a new account. Just like Marty, just like William, just like Feds. You can't just kick them off YouTube because they're being mean. It doesn't make them just go away from the world. This has got to stop. People's lives are being put in danger. Very real fucking danger. These people have followed me to and from court. These people have slandered my name. These people have tried to have me kidnapped. These people have tried to have me murdered. And this is the kind of shit that they do because they don't care, because they're psychotic. That's why I'm asking all of you, my friends, to that do not have the letter for the email that I want you all to send to YouTube. I need every single one of you to message me so you guys can send it to them. Because this has to be brought to their attention. Because if something is not done, someone's going to get hurt or killed. Enough is enough. We need to do something about this. So for those of you that do not have the letter, message me right away and I'll send you the letter to send in to YouTube. And when you send in the letter to YouTube, make sure you attach your links. If you guys need any kind of evidence, let me know. I'll send you that shit. Because I have evidence on USB sticks. I have evidence on my old hard drive. On the original hard drive that came with my computer that I bought. I have all kinds of evidence. So if anybody needs that shit, let me know. And I'll be more than happy to send y'all video clips, screenshots, whatever you need. Let's put a stop to this so that my family doesn't have to suffer anymore. And so that I can get my life back. This has got to stop, people. Because I don't want my friends or my family hurting or suffering anymore. I'm tired of sitting by and just watching this go on. Something needs to be done. And I can't do it without you guys. I seriously need every single one of y'all's help. Every last one of you that's a friend of me, I need y'all's help. And bad. Let's put a stop to these people so that no one gets hurt. So like I said, if you guys need the letter, let me know, and I'll send that to you right away. Oh, and CBG, fuck you. No one even likes you, man. Move on. And leave me and my friends and my family the fuck alone. Otherwise, legal action is going to be forthcoming, and it will be taken. Awesome. Well, good video, Cyrax. You know, you've never tried winding to Facebook before, so I'm sure that's going to work out just so well this time. But, you know, thanks for watching, guys. And, uh, you know, have a wonderful night.